Uh, it's true that uh, 2012, you know, obviously was a pretty good year for us and, uh, and uh, chasing the top team was the big teams and uh, having our first long awaited victory was uh, clearly a very, very nice moment for us and for the whole team. Um, targets obviously for 2013 needs more, we need to be more ambitious and uh, uh, break into the top three of the Constructor Championship and uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully we can have some more wins as well to, to, to help the morale of the team to really, really be happy. I think we 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 are lucky and we have one of the best pair of drivers in the in the paddock. Uh, we have the experience, the charisma, uh, leadership. On the other hand, we have the eagerness, the speed, and and maybe the future. So um, for me, it was key, you know, to get some continuity at least over a couple of years and more, if possible. Uh, you can see that all the top teams they have the same driver lineup since years, you know, and uh, and when you know the process behind the scene, obviously, to have both drivers now they know all the process, they know the people in the team, you create this momentum and this relationship between them and the team, it's obviously it's going to be much easier, let's say, to deliver and perform. I mean, my first impression, obviously, it's. Uh, um, we, we did a good job just to, I think, to keep the sexy and glamorous part of the car. I think the, the car was voted last year the best uh, livery by the fans and, uh, and I expect, obviously, to keep at least this. Um, but uh, behind the scene again, obviously, I know the car, the guy here at Enstone, they were very hard and they did a very good job. I know the car will be more performing this year than the car last year, so it's a good start. I think the morale is a mix of uh, excitement <coughs> and enthusiasm. Uh, it's clear that uh, last year, you know, it was, I, I repeat myself, but you know, you just create, we created the momentum, you know, by uh, at first building uh, podiums, having a nice pair of drivers, um, having this first victory with Kimi, and a lot of stories around. I mean, and the image of the team is, uh, is good, you know, so I think it's a mix between these two feelings. Uh, everybody is, I know, throw everything they could, you know, into this new project and uh, I know the car, the car will be I think delivering the expectation of the team and obviously after we the race team as the drivers we can put it everything in place for the, on the track. You have to build expectation and be optimistic because this is the target is to be better. Uh, today we know we will be better in 2013 uh, compared with 2012. Uh, the only the only unknown parameter in this is we don't know how much the team gonna improve, you know. So, I mean, uh, after some some week of testing in February, we should know more, a little bit, at least a little bit more about, uh, let's say, the relative performance between the teams. But uh, we are definitely confident uh, that we we will be doing better this year. First of all, as you may know, we have tested Davide during our young driver test in Abu Dhabi, so we could have a clear picture about uh, what he is capable of and what he's doing. And uh, I think he did perform well, but not only performing, he, he did uh, the job the engineer was expecting him to do. So that was a clear ticking the box. Um, on top of this, he's a GP2 champion, so I think he showed everybody he has uh, the race craft and the performance, you know, to, to deliver. So I think it's, uh, I'm happy to give him a chance, you know, to to be part of a, a big organization in Formula One. It's going to be obviously for him very intense, a lot to learn, uh, a lot to discover. But uh, it's part of the job and it's part of the education we can give to young driver. Both drivers, obviously, Jerome has a long history with us already, um, uh, as well as uh, Nicolas. I mean, Nicolas did some uh, development for us and, uh, and obviously was testing in Abu Dhabi. Uh, Jerome, obviously, was third driver last year and uh, we give him now another chance in another role, which is obviously to participate to developing the car in the simulator and uh, any opportunity. So both these guys deserve to be to be here today, you know, on the and they're standing next to us because they, 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 they are doing a great job in the back of the scene. Everything they do is obviously bringing performance to the team. We did challenge the accepted order. And obviously I know the quality of the work the people here produced last year. 
and I also know the, 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 the job and the work they, pro they will produce for this year and uh, we will definitely challenge again the accepted order and obviously target now is to be accepted as, uh, as being part of the order. Body at an angle, that's it. Like that. And the other way. A little less, a little less. That's it. Okay, got it at an angle. We'll do all kinds of pockets, okay? Yeah. And the other way. Some white stuff as well. Okay, now hands out of the pockets. I can't grasp this. <laughs> <laughs> 